Well, hello there, and welcome back to Kazad Doom on Divide and Conquer version 5. We are nearly 100 turns in, and we haven't really gone very far. Although, we are now spilled out of our little mountain, and we're residing in Anon Enorod, the gates of the mountain, and Austin Athiel is now a viable target. We are currently defending our mountain with Barlin and his collection of vagabonds and misfits. But we do have a Dwarven Catapult, so we feel much more secure, um, even if the faction leader of Moria's I'm Goblins you. seems to want to reside outside. So we're feeling quite good about ourselves. We can't leave Anon Enerod yet, but we are hoping that that will solve itself. Dream scenario is going to be that Oin gets to adopt someone and they can then take over the governorship of the gates. But we'll see. Onwards and upwards. We've also got quite a nice little army forming in Kazadun proper as opposed to Thra's gate. Thra being the mighty general who fought to the last when we lost it. And hopefully we can hold and we're going to get a second army out on the eastern side of the mountain, on the west bank of the Anduin. And then we can really start making progress. But apart from that, it's all going a little bit slowly. But that's, I suppose that's, you can't really stop that. Hopefully. Oh, they've all gone somewhere. Hopefully we can get down to Austin Athiel and take the forge. I don't think it gives us any bonuses as the dwarves, though. I think if you're Lothlorien or the Woodland Realm, if you can never get this far, it does upgrade your units. But Oh, look at that. Boom. It's a long beard. Dale's been crippled. The Gundabad are just having an absolute field day. Can you stay there? No, not yet. And he looks suspiciously like Gimli. So we can't actually leave Aye, yet. Aye, my liege. But it is something in the offing. So actually he can make himself useful and build me some towers. We march no further today. Aye, sire. Building a watchtower. Thra's gates built a catapult. That's nice. Good news. We have two catapults. We're definitely never losing that again. Um, what could we do? Armor or money? What's our money situation like? Probably take armor whilst we've got a bit of leeway. Oh, Barlin's had an upgrade. That's very good news. What's your next upgrade? Oh, I can't take him out to find out. Urgh. Yeah, we'll keep going then. It's, it's just so close to... Oh, you can see the map just slightly altering there because... Dale has fallen to Gundabad. Gundabad are going to be insane in the end game on this one. They have the whole of the north from Gundabad all the way over to Erebor. And they've got Thranduil's Halls, Dale, Erebor, Dane's Halls. Got a shed load of territory. All of it good and unique. So that's going to be worry. Oh! Looks like they're going to try and force Thra's gate. But we've got Barlin. Barlin Longsword. 
I suppose he wouldn't have a sword, would he? He'd be like strong axe. Let's get ourselves another little watchtower up. I sire, building a watchtower. On. Oh, that's good news for us. I wonder if they're actually going to siege us. As soen as Anon Enerod has built its miners' quarters, that should be enough to keep the population under control. And then we can either attack those... For I don't think we need to. I think with a one dwarven catapult, I think... And they have to run through the singular doorway into the mountain, the Silver Time Gate which has now been renamed Thra's Gate in his honour. Um, I would imagine we'd be able to hold that. We can push south. Good. Good. The enemy lay siege, but we will stand proud. Can, is it ready now? What does it give us? We're on 60%. That gives us 20%. That'll be fine. I noble sire. In your name, so we're going to assume Barling can hold that. I have every faith in him. Kazadun's built a market. going again as well. We can't upgrade it, but it's always nice to see. Oh, pants. Anonena Rod has not got proper governance like I wanted. Oh, shitesa. So we're going to have to take Oin back. There's a lot of elves knocking around in Brunost. And they've baggered off. Well, no, he's got a wife, but won't help us now. Well, that wasn't really what we wanted. I suppose we better build a militia garrison. That will give us some extra. Something to public order. Where did that army go? There he is. What is in it? I'm gonna stick you. It's quite. It's got that warg pack that causes so much damage. I sire, my king, I lord. To betray you. Maybe it was because they got in the buildings got damaged when we left a turn early. We'll try again. mustered a full stack. We're not allies with the elves, are we? We would very much like Zag Kala. I wonder if they'll let me buy it off them. Because we have lots of monies. Lots and lots and lots.
forget just how late in the game we actually are. Yes, my king. Where are you going? You're going back to us in the thill, right? So can, can we kill their faction leader? That would be good. Edoras is under siege. We didn't talk to the Ardenheim, so they're upset. That would be helpful. Healer traits on the wall. I know what's up. Marching now. We march to battle. Right. Let's kill some goblins. Attack. And hopefully kill the faction leader. A nice hill to station our baluster on top of. That's good. Dwarves. Dwarves. Put them down the hill. And then we'll just have. Oh, you can go on the left. You can go on the right. Turn about. You're not on skirmish, and you can be on fire at will. Still falling short. Let's go kill the halberd unit. Do they have any cav? No. And we do, so that'll be nice for routing. Are any of them gonna hit their target? Yeah, about time. It's annoying that Ballister always aim for the middle of the unit and then they'll be, you see that keeps hitting from this one spot and there's no men there. Skirmishers, black bit of infantry. we can replace the baluster with the actual catapults the better because they just don't kill enough I mean it's doing all right
Leo. Okay, Dwarven Charge, in we go. to the dwarves. Or he improves himself for once. At last, rather. Only half the enemy force oh, remains. Nine percent. We did all right. The mighty merchant cavalry from Bree charging across the battlefield. A general on general fight. Okay, maybe not because we can't get to him. There, General, there he is. Masses of dwarves. Oh boy, he doesn't die. Best to give it a bit of a charge. Oh no, take these first.
break. Rubbish in my life. Get ready, everybody's routing, so it's just time to kill the general. There we are. Look how our cowards is a clear victory. We'll take that. We'll take it. Mighty dwarven victory that it is. Ten thousand. Oh no. And hopefully, we're going to march that way. Right. So we're a little bit closer to having an army created here. We could do with you. Getting me a general. That'll be nice. And we can cobble together something out of those. Can we not recruit any more archers? Oh, that's a shame. Do an end turn. And we're going to end. I'm afraid this is going to be a rather short video today. Because I've just realised the time. And we're going to have to be off. So we're going to just quickly do the economy for the next turn. And then we've had a battle. We've sort of set ourselves on the way to victory. Which is nice. We'll just see what else we can build in Kazadul. And then for the very, very first time, I'm going to go and find out how you put petrol in a car. Which is going to be interesting. I'm assuming it's self-explanatory. But I don't know. I'm not a very practical man. I don't... Things that are very, very simple, I find, for some reason, I find really difficult. Edoras is gone. We're getting a military unit if we talk to the Ardenaim. Let's do that quickly. My lord. What is it you Trade wish to rights. discuss? You hold Would another you like proposition for maps? us then? This proposal is of little that. interest. Just to see what you do have. Nimrzir. We cannot thank you. Well, that seems fruitful. Farewell. Dwarven labors. Thank God. My king. Mark. I, my liege. A proud victory. A most noble conquest, sire. Keep your march up side. down south. Got the general coming. It's just Kazadum. What can we build here? Oh, I think we want that. Do we want that yet? Another armor tier. And then we've got an army that's kind of ready to go for the next episode as well, once they're all those units are trained and up to speed. So that'll be good. So I'm afraid it's a little bit shorter. 25 minutes, you've got some value for money. We've had a battle, and Oi now marches towards the forge at Ostinathiel to see if we can take it for the dwarves. But thank you very much for watching. If indeed you have, do take care of yourselves. Goodbye for now. Promise the next one will be the original length. But please be kind in the comments. Don't call me names and things. But bye for now.